with our photocopy now transferred to our piece of wood, you could end it there, that's just fine, or you can consider adding a bunch of different effects. And the first of these effects we're going to cover are putting on some acrylic paints on top of your photocopy. Now you can mix your paints off on like an own palette, or you can just continue to use your own wood. What I'm going to do here is just that. I want to go for some orange, so I'm going to put on some red and some yellow. Now after these guys are on here, I'm going to reach over and I'm going to get my brush. And what I'm going to do with the brush is I'm going to start mixing these guys up. Mixing these together right on, right on the canvas because I want to get that nice orange color. Now, if it's a situation where like, you know, I don't want things that thick, grab some water. Acrylics are great. You can cut them with water and make really thin colors. See, now look how much thinner that is. You can even go thinner yet. It's really, it's all up to you. Because see, now what you can do is you can start flanking your photocopy with this nice orange, making it as thin as you want or as thick as you want. What's more, you can also go up onto the photocopy itself and start adding in some very, very thin pigment. Especially this works better, of course, on the wider areas. But it's something you can consider doing for additional lighting effects, pigments, just like just various texture.